we have two means of post-installed anchorage into cured concrete, your traditional chemical epoxy anchor or your mechanical wedge anchor. And there's pros and cons to each, and we can discuss a bit of both. So with your chemical epoxy anchor, this one's a little bit more expensive and requires more site labor, but it has a stronger structural capacity. So what they do here is they pre-drill a hole, clean it, and then they fill it with a chemical epoxy. So you're relying on that adherence between the anchor, chemical epoxy, and concrete to withstand any of those tensile or pull-out forces and keep your assembly uh, strong and intact within the substrate. But this one obviously requires intensive quality control assurance because you're relying so heavily on your adherence of the resin to the substrate. This one, on the other hand, a mechanical wedge anchor, these are a little bit quicker and more efficient to install, but you may require more of them because they don't have as much structural capacity as the epoxy anchor. So what happens is as you're torquing down the bolt, this cone or sleeve actually expands. So when you get those tensile or pullout forces, you have this counteracting the force within the concrete substrate. So there's really pros and cons of each of these uh, methodologies, and some people have one preference or the other, but let me know what your experience has been in the past with mechanical wedge anchors versus chemical epoxy anchors.